Ladies and gentlemen, Mark of Matt Braddock! Give me a hell yeah! <laughs> What's up, dude? Hey, how's it going? How you been? Good, good, good. I'm, I'm, I've been driving around delivering weed right now. It's pretty funny. <laughs> oh! Smoke weed every day. Hell yeah. yeah. Perfect. First of all, perfect. Yeah, perfect. Multi, local band smoker. Yeah, multi question, <laughs> real quick. Uh, if you could please properly introduce yourself, let us know whereabouts in the world you are. Plug or promote anything you like. Favorite strain of weed. <laughs> uh, well, ir ironically, I'm not that much of a smoker. I, I used to smoke a lot when I was back in New Zealand, and I would pretty much just smoke whatever they gave me, which was um, we would have these little. Um, I would call them tinny houses back in New Zealand. So you would go, you'd go to a, you go to a house and you'd knock on the door and, you, and I'd say, "How many do you want?" And you say, "I want two tinnies." And I'd go back and I'd, I'd bring back like two little, um, I guess it was a like gram, give you twenty bucks and 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 just whatever it was, you just had it. I thought a tinny um, was was yeah. a beer in Australia or in New Zealand. A, tin, a tinny is a beer yeah, in Australia. In New Zealand, it's. Um, like uh, they would call them tinny houses, and it's it's like like a gram of weed. It come like wrapped in like aluminium foil. Okay, it's pretty funny. Actually. Oh, okay, got you. I got yeah. you. Yeah, yeah. So. Hell yeah, we do. Yeah. Thanks, uh, yeah. thanks for hanging out with us. Uh, promote, promote, or plug anything you like, real quick. Yeah, yeah, sweet. Well, um, yeah. So I'm originally from New Zealand, moved to Australia. Now I'm here in California, um, and I started the project Rav Medic. Um, which is cool. It's it's not really a band as such. Um, it was just it was just something I decided to do after um, I was in a band in Australia called Balasera, and we ended up in America. And then um, I was like, the band stopped, and I was like, I'm just going to write some songs, and then hopefully I can get some friends of mine or some some singers that I like or drummers that I like um, to play on it, and. Um, I was fortunate that a lot of them, you know, were keen to do it, and um, yeah, so I just put out an album. And Chloe, um, Chloe's your other it. your other band member, correct? Oh, that's that's just another project that started just recently. Um, we sort of did a collaboration on a song, and then um, yeah, and then um, yeah, we kind of got signed to a label, and then just sort of. Oh yeah, and and then we kind of you know we just yeah. kind of we kind of just got signed to a label. Yeah! Hell yeah. <laughs> Congratulations, dude. That's awesome. That is awesome. Um, I want to play I want to play the battle, which I believe is the first song I ever heard from you guys. And uh, I think this video is so artistically amazing as far as like the visual content of it. Who is the director of this video? Um, well, it was just some footage that I um, I found that this this dancer in England. Um, he sort of choreographs all this stuff to sort of more like hip hop stuff. And I told him about my song. He's like, yep, I'll get a bunch of footage for you to use. He just sort of gave me a bunch of footage. And then I just tried my best to kind of sync it up to like the music and make it as, as weird looking as possible. <laughs> but, it's so yeah. like, it's really, really cool. Uh, we're hanging out with Mark oh, of nice. Rav Medic. This is the battle. Is this, is this an abandoned city? Is that how you describe the footage? Yeah, yeah, I think so. I think it's somewhere in like Manchester or Essex or someplace like that. That's pretty cool. <laughs> That's insane. I wonder why it was abandoned. So crazy. Yeah, I know. It's weird, right? I, it, it looks kind of like the apocalypse, doesn't it? But yeah. Interesting. <laughs> yeah. What's up? What's yeah, the new? It is wild. <laughs> So the newest record that you guys have, the one with uh, what's the title? I don't recall off the top of my head. I'm sorry. The one that you have with Chloe. What? Oh, that's called uh, Mana. Mana. M A. Oh, M N A N A. Yeah, yeah, there it is. Oh, yeah. How did, how did you link up with her though? Because that's is that not the daughter of Rob from Metallica? That's that's the wife of Rob from Metallica. Oh, I'm, yeah. excuse me, the <laughs> wow. wife. I thought it was dark. She looks that young in the video. Com compliment wow. to her. She looks that young in the video. So, but how do, how does how do you link yeah. up with her? Um, 
we had a mutual friend and um, she was putting on um, a show at the Troubadour, like a charity event thing. And um, we sort of connected on the socials and then we were just like, look, do you want to do a song together? I'm like, cool. I just sent her a bunch of music. She sent some vocals back and then that was pretty much it. And then we were just like, this is kind of really easy and comfortable. Let's just keep doing it. And that's kind of what happened. But it, it's... It's just a different world, you know what I mean? Like, you know, have, you know, her husband's like Rob from Metallica. It's a whole different like. So you get you get just, you get free yeah, you get free tickets to all free. the shows now. Free tickets to all the yeah. shows, right? Yeah. <laughs> um, but yeah, but the whole the whole Trujillo family is just insanely talented. Like the the son Ty, um, like played with Corn and then played. I think yeah. he's playing with Suicide Tendencies right now, and he's just like. It's like, what the hell? Yeah. It's uh, next level kind it's, of thing. It's in the yeah. DNA. It's in the Trujillo DNA for yeah. sure. Um, can you talk about the writing that went into to Mana as far as the the particular like lyrical content of the song? I know I know yeah, that so, she's so Chloe, a, a, did a lot of vocals for it, but did you have like influence what her, her writing what she was writing about? No, no. It, it's kind of like the same with the Rav Medic album. I kind of record it backwards to what like a traditional band would do, which would be I'd go to a nice studio and I'd do the drums first and I'd do the bass and I'd do the guitar. And whereas because essentially I am the band, I guess, I just I just go into a studio, do all the I just do a, a click track and a guitar. I just get like a solid guitar track down. And then I send that to Chloe and or whoever the singer is. In this case, it's Chloe, and then she'll she'll start working on on the vocals and the lyrics and the melodies. And then and then I sort of get a drummer to add drums. And then at the very last moment, I add the bass to sort of work around the vocals and stuff. But yes, yeah, so I kind of do it backwards. I do the guitar first, but um, I just I've just kind of got used to doing it like that. And I, so <laughs> I just keep. Doing it's cool. It. Whatever works. Whatever works. You meet your drummer. Uh, drummer, we used to play in, um, in my Aussie band, Balasera, together. So um, I sort of kept in touch with her, and the, and I needed a, a drummer for the video. And, and I was you said, like, yeah, you said come over to California real like, quick, and let's let's kick it and shoot a video, yeah, and yeah. I'll buy you a beer. Yeah, yeah. So she, <laughs> yeah, she's, she's super cool. She used to play in, um, I don't know if she's still playing them, their band Saliva. Remember Saliva? Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. That song. Um, click click boom. What was that main song there? Yeah, that's pretty cool. <laughs> yeah. Click click yeah, so boom. Yeah, cool. yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, I didn't. I didn't know she was a drummer for stuff. That's awesome. Whereabouts in in California? Yeah. You, so you're primarily in Los Angeles, or? Uh, I'm in. Well, when I first came over here in like 2014, I think it was. I came to Burbank, um, and now I'm just living in um, Costa Mesa. And Orange County, cool. Yeah, hell yeah, I'm I'm in Where that area. I'm I'm in Victorville. He's in Buffalo, New York. Um, but I'm in I'm in oh. Anaheim often at at the Chain Reaction over there. Um, in fact, I'll be there oh, yeah, in yeah. like uh, two weekends, in the twenty two two and a half nice. weekends. Yeah, the twenty seventh for Andy Sizik. Um, all right, yeah. hell yeah. Uh, dude, are you down to review some artists with us and or do some trivia, which could win you a prize, but probably will punish either me or my co host Oh, by the way, this is... I, 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 I apologize for not introducing you guys. This is Mikey Toes, a.k.a. Know, Mikey fun. Toxic of Surrender the Hope out of Buffalo, New York. Oh, nice, nice, nice. He's in a, he's in a metal band. Like out of New York right now? Is it, is it freezing out there? Oh, uh, yeah, it's cold as hell. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we've been dealing with a lot of snow and single digit temperatures, but that's just how the winter goes here. We're used to it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Mark, we've been starting to put on some uh some more more and more gigs uh -huh. lately. Uh, as far as local band smoke out regarding like shows in Southern California, Could, is Rav Medic bookable to play shows if we were to reach out and be like jump on a jump on a gig a couple months from now? Yeah, yeah, we should be. We're um, we've got about eight songs. Yeah, we probably just need like about a month or two to sort of get the live set sort of down. 
and then and then we should be cool to play some shows for sure. Yeah, fuck yeah. Cool. This would, this would probably more than likely be like May, June, July ish, like or falling around those time yeah. frames. So. Cool. We'll talk. We'll talk. Yeah, cool, cool. Let's review some artists together. This cool, is dude. Fireproof <laughs> from Cashed Out. Wait, is it Casual Encounters can... or Fireproof? I'm not sure. What do you guys think of that? I like it. Oh, oh yeah. It's chill. Cashed yeah, Out. Like yeah, that, that was a good one. Cashed Out. Fireproof. But it was the acoustic version, so there's a non-acoustic version. That was a banger. Oh, yeah. Next would be light. We take control. But first, I owe DeLong a spin. DeLong, you can pick a character, any character in the entire world. It just can't be somebody that's green. What that means, Mark, is this entire time I have a face filter on right now. So at any time, someone can say, I want you to be Iron Man, and then boom, you're talking to me, and I look like Iron Man. It's going to happen here any second. Okay. Light will take control is next. Yeah, what do you guys think of that? Yeah. That was sick. Mark, what did you think of that one? Yeah. That's yay. That's five yays. Hell yeah. Mark, we're gonna play one more, one more from Rav Medic. What would you prefer we play, sir? Maybe we'll play Rise Again. Rav Medic with Rise Again, featuring Jennifer Both of We Are Riot. Mark, we know you gotta hustle them trees, brother. But we appreciate you taking some time out of your day to hang out with this dude. Uh, please invite That's me to a friends. show. Let's link up soon. I'm in Southern California also. Let's link up soon and do something. Yeah, but uh, other than that, brother, be safe. Enjoy your 2022. And uh, we'll catch you soon. Awesome. Thank you, man. Hell yeah. Cheers. Ladies and gentlemen, Mark. Awesome. Thanks, guys. Of Rav Medic. Give me a hell yeah.